Hi YouTube, it's me, Ellie, and I'm gonna make a video. So, this is a rather serious video, so you'll have to pardon my comical Eskimo fur, which I'm using to keep warm because it is freezing. <sighs> Anyways, today I would like to talk to you guys about kind of two subjects. Mostly one subject, but a tint of two. Um, I don't like being political because I don't like starting fights, and as many of you YouTubers probably know, there's a lot of drama that goes on on the internet, and I don't really like it. I don't like getting involved in fights. I don't like drama. I'm much more of a person who sits and has a deep conversation and does not join like a dog pile. So today I posted a blog on some random website about how California just shut down 800 marijuana facilities, like medical marijuana. So I got a little upset about that unrelated to the fact, like, that I either do smoke or do not smoke pot. It doesn't matter. It's just about the fact that, you know, I have friends who use medical marijuana to not be in constant pain because of terminal, terminally, terminal diseases. And I was a little upset about it because I come from Boston and here mar marijuana is decriminalized and we're very close to getting it legalized. And regardless if you smoke or not, a lot of people are just pro-legalization. I don't want to get into, like, the whole argument and debate because it's, it's an entire political discussion. So that's not the point. But I posted this, and it didn't have to do with me being like, yeah, everyone should smoke pot, man. It was more like, hey, this kind of sucks. And I want to know what you guys are thinking. So some people posted and they were nice about it. Some people disagreed with me. Some people were neutral. Some people said some really funny stuff that made me giggle. But then one dude, who was, happened to be a forum moderator, hopped into the blog and said something pretty douchey along the lines of like, Oh, I feel so bad for you, you poor pothead. Like... Too bad you'll have to go, like, buy it somewhere else. And it kind of just really got me upset. And I know I shouldn't let some guy who's a moderator on a forum get me upset. Because it's, like, it's silly and it's pointless. And it won't get me any gratification to be mad at him. But it honestly says something about the way people react in arguments and debates. First of all, he assumed that I was a pothead, and he was making a clear joust at my lifestyle, which he has no idea about. For all he knows, I could be, like, a nun. That's just pro-legalization. And as, it has nothing to do with, like, whether I'm pro-drug use or not. Or, I could be a heroin user or an addict. He has no idea. And it was very interesting to me that he clearly used pothead in a derogatory manner to imply that I'm some college dropout who just does drugs all day, which is actually pretty far from the truth. And, you know, it really bothered me because he's making an assumption and essentially boxing in everyone who smokes into like a category and assuming that I smoke. So it's really silly, especially being a forum moderator. So you got you you know, you have to set an example. You gotta show people, especially young members, like this is what it this is what it means to be a formal, respectable person. <sighs> I sound like such a drama queen right now, but in all honesty, like I guess it's just it shows to me how disrespectful people can be because it's not like this is the first time this guy has 
started up with me. I wouldn't have been as annoyed if it was just this once, but, you know, he has clearly, like, gotten into quarrels with me. And th it's, like, over s small things, and he's never really spoken to me. So he really can't get a full picture of who I am, especially online. You can't really know who someone is online, but if you're gonna be a dick, then I just, unless you're doing it for your esteem and to gratify your insecurities and gain power online, and I just don't see the point. I'm just one of those people that believes people should try to be as inherently good as they possibly can, and I realize that's not, like, something that's attainable because there are going to be people who feel the need to be condescending, but I guess what people should take away from this is that I'm not trying to say everyone should smoke weed or be pro-legalization. I'm saying that if you disagree with someone, you got to be respectful. You got you have to tell someone this is what I think and you know, feel free to argue with me, but don't be derogatory. Don't be like a jerk about it. It, it I guess it's funny and it will start like I guess that's why trolls do it, because they like seeing people freak out, and I agree, I think people freaking out is funny, but you can't do it to everyone, because not everyone is looking to, is looking to, like, start drama. Some people are legitimately looking for, like, a good conversation, and I know that I do, because I love conversations a lot, and I don't get enough intellectual stimulation. So... It was kind of unfortunate to receive a crude remark from a forum moderator, but that's just my five cents. And I still love you regardless if you're pro-legalization or not, or if you have purple teeth or blue hair or whatever. I still love you. Anyways, I think I'm going to end my little rant now. But thank you for listening and stay tuned for more videos.